huge defensive possession for Furman to try to keep clawing back in. They've got it 16 with 12 to go. Their goal is to get it down to 10. Seventeen point lead here for the Eagles. So far in his rookie year of his NBA career, Vaudrin can crash the glass, get the rebounds for you, averaging seven and a half rebounds per game. He does not have his own shoe deal though. No, or a loudmouth dad. Herman wants to be at the end of the season. Both coaches telling us separately that you know the four year contract they signed to play this series was really because it's tough for both teams to get home games. Great cut by Vaudrin. Johnny Buckets. Sounds like your kid, Johnny Buckets. Yeah, Johnny Buckets. He's not making as many buckets as he, uh, as he should be. <laughs> Eagles get it into Falden. And Optic was actually forced by the effort of Zunik, who ran back to eliminate the potential pass for the additional, uh, to, to make that really a two-on-one. He got back and made it a two-on-two. -two. How about a bullet pass in for Talford, the fake, and he Owls. Leading the Camels. Winthrop has 12 points from Adonis Arms, 10 from Chuck Falden. Nice pass underneath. King with the lead of seven. 440 to play here in Rock Hill. Both teams trying to instill their will. Nice dump down underneath. Coming up just shy in the Big South Championship. He said he'd give it a one and four shot. I, I see you disagree. Well, I'm, I think Joe, I heard that he believes in Santa Claus, too, so that's what makes Joe so good. And Joe and Artie on the broadcast early next. Falden returned, went to his leading scorer, averaging 12.8 points per game. A great testament to the development here at Winthrop. Winthrop goes into DJ Burns, and DJ... Winthrop's lead is 18. Was as high as 21. Nice look. Nice. It's 10 rebounds, so needs two points and an assist for the triple-double. We'll monitor that. And this 